Got a new Christmas present uh, pedal for my wife that I asked her for. Um, it's a Behringer Octaver pedal, SO400. Um, so it's like the octave fuzz pedal that Behringer puts out. Um, I thought I'd just play around with it and do a little demo, mess with some of the settings, um, let you see what it sounds like through my guitar, which is Epiphone SG, uh, Warren Cherry, Vintage. Um, and then I'm coming out of a Crate GFX 212. Um, and I'm mainly going to be playing with uh, Bridge Pickup. <coughs> Anyways, so first off, Octaver Pedal. Kind of produces some cool sounds. I uh, the first setting that I'll do is the drive, uh, which is the bottom setting, which is the fuzz setting, <coughs> and I've got the direct um, about three o'clock and the octave at three o'clock as well, and I'm gonna do the fuzz about midway just to see what that sounds like. Um, so, give it a shot here. Turn the fuzz up a bit. I'm going to just go all the way max. So not much sustain with the high notes. Doctor pedals really meant to do that. Not much for like chords. Okay, let's try the other setting. The next setting is says octave two, which is the middle setting here. Um, and the fuzz, I don't think really, or drive isn't going to affect this one. But I'm going to leave the octave at three o'clock and the direct at three o'clock as well, the direct signal. Let's see what that sounds like.
doesn't really sound good. But for those bassy notes, if you add some distortion, I'm going to add a big muff to it. Okay, um, I'm gonna try going for the last setting here, poly, and the range. I'm gonna put about three o'clock. I'm gonna let everything have about three o'clock going here. kind of cut out there so for the higher notes it doesn't uh, do the octave but for the lower ones it does I'm gonna put the range a little bit lower so like at nine o'clock and see what that sounds like Cuts out a lot quicker. Basically, just the very lowest notes is it going to catch there? Let's try 12. So, I kind of like a, going 3 o'clock all the way. Maybe a little more or less. with the DS1 again. Anyways, that's kind of uh, the settings here. Those are the settings I like. I didn't really mess with the direct and the octave. You can um, put the direct out down lower and so you get mostly the octave sound going. Let's try it on the octave level, second setting. So you can get some gnarly sounds that way. And let's kind of do the opposite and do less of the octave, more of the direct. Anyway, 
anyways, get the idea. Um, it has a base in. Maybe I'll do another video that I do the bass with this, which is really cool. You can do the guitar or the bass with this pedal. Um, it's also got a direct out and an out A. Um, I don't have an effects loop going through my amp. If I did, I would have both of these um, plugged in. But this is the one that you plug in if you're just doing using it as a single pedal in your effects chain. You just put it in the out A position there in whatever, a guitar or bass. So that's the Behringer Super Octaver SO400. And pretty sweet pedal. I'm just starting to mess around with it and getting some cool sounds with it. So stay tuned and I'll have a, probably a new song soon um, with using this pedal. But if you have any questions, leave comments. And uh, thanks for watching.